Hi guys, so this is another battle. This is going to be the Nars versus Elf. So these are both glosses, and this is called Orgasm. I'm guessing this is taken after the blush that I still need to get my hands on because I have a great drugstore dupe for that. I got this for free in one of my little Elf free bundles, which I showed you in one of my Elf hauls. So if you spend over £25 you get a couple of free gifts as long as you put like a coupon code in which is on their main page. And I got this one called Pout Perfecta and this is like I said by Elf. And in the bottles, in the bottles they don't look that similar. This one's obviously a little bit more peacher and this is a bit more pinker. But I thought it'd be a nice comparison considering how cheap this is compared to how expensive this is. I know no one really talks about the Nars lip glosses but I thought as I had it already in my collection, it might be worth just seeing if this could compare. So this is the Nards packaging. It has no writing on the bottle whatsoever. It's very simple. But it has obviously got Nars at the top. So it has the shade name on the bottom. And then this is the Elf one. It's very similar. Obviously it's thinner than the Nars one. And it has the name on the front. And then there is also a stick on the bottom to say that it's called Glow. So, the swatches. So, this is the Nars one at the bottom. And then this is the Elf one at the top. Obviously, they're both very, very shimmery. I don't know why, but it seems to be coming off on camera kind of... Like, it's hard to see the pink. But it is... It does have a pink shimmer in it. They're not perfect matches. I never said they were going to be. But I thought it might be a nice little comparison. The Nars applicator has a doe foot which is pretty bog standard for most lip glosses but the e.l.f. one has a brush applicator and that's one of the reasons why this was coming off so streaky because obviously a brush applicator is not the easiest thing to deal with but I will put them on my lips now and I'll let you guys be the judge okay I'm back so I will get a little bit closer to see if you guys can tell I just imagine there's a line down the centre of my lips so this side on the left is the NARS and it's got more of a golden sheen to it. And the right side is the elf. And you can kind of tell it's got more of a pink sheen to it. So, Nars side. And elf side. The feeling of them, I would definitely say that I prefer the Nars one just because it's a lot more, it's a bit thicker. It's not sticky, which is really nice. I don't know, this one I can still kind of feel the lips in. I'm personally not the biggest fan of gloss, lip glosses. If I do put a lip gloss on, I will put it on top of something. But I just wanted you to see it on bare lips. I will now get a lip colour and I will layer them over the top on my hand just so you can see if there's any difference. Okay, so this is the... Kat Von D Lolita, I have it here. So I have that just completely matte there and I'm going to put each gloss on either side and I'll try and leave like a little stripe in the middle just so you can see what it's like matte versus elf versus Nars. So you can see on the left is Nars and then on the right is the elf one and you can definitely see the difference in colour now. So this, the left one is more golden and the right one is more pink. So the winner of this battle is the NARS Orgasm Lip Gloss. I know it's expensive, but I don't know, the feeling, the feeling of it, the sheen, it's just, personally, I find it much, much nicer. So I hope you guys like this video. If you did, please leave a like. It would really help me. If you want to subscribe, I would really, really appreciate it. And let's have a chat in the comments below. I would love that. And I'll see you guys all next time. Bye.